Hey, how's it going? <laughs> I was just thinking about how a lot of the scholarly feminists, if you're wondering what are these clicking sounds, I'm just kind of holding a pen and flipping this little thing, if you've wondered what that sound was. But a lot of the scholarly feminists and the scholarly uh, sociology people, <laughs> and that's such an uneducated way of saying it, but oh well. Um, the way that they discuss things so often, they, they don't want a discussion. And, and, and some people, it's not even just sociology. It's, it's when people have formally studied something for a long time. They no longer actually have conversations with other people anymore. It's either they will try to teach someone something or it's about sort of bragging what you know about a particular element of something. So it's kind of like, um, okay, there's someone, there's someone who knows all about a certain kind of piece of electronics, right? And, you know, they've worked with that kind of thing for so long, whatever that kind of electronics is, right? They've, they've worked with it for 10 years. They know it left and right. But every so often there'll be something that they'll have to, uh, they'll have to look at the manual. They'll have to reference the manual. Oh, that's what that is, or that's where that is, right? And then you have someone else who never works with that stuff, maybe fiddles with it once in a while and breaks something. And maybe they don't have to break something, but I just, they, they barely work with it, basically, right? But they have memorized the manual from top to bottom and even can recite you different parts of it word for word, right? It's one of those thick manuals too, right? And so it's like that person getting into an argument with the person who's actually worked with this stuff for 10 years. And you know, the person that's, that's studied the manual and knows all this stuff about it, that's what a lot of these, these scholarly feminists are like trying to talk with. I mean, it's the opposite of down to earth. There was someone whom I was having a discussion with recently who was saying that, well, you know, uh, so many of the, the, the conversations on YouTube, the way it's expected is to be sort of like if you got together with a stranger at a bar and just had a conversation. I say, well, that's what, I don't know why you're saying that in a negative way. That's how things usually go. That's what a conversation is. You know, so let, let's go back to my, 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 uh, my example of uh, my analogy of the, uh, uh, the user manual, the manual for some piece of electronics, right? And to the person who studied all, you know, knows that manual from top to bottom, you know, to them, a conversation is getting together with someone else who has read that from top to bottom and reciting little pieces of, of what that manual, uh, uh, you know, the exact wording of that parts of that manual. And that's what some of these people think a conversation is. Well, I'm, I'm not uh, intellectually f fulfilled enough to have other types of conversations with you lowlifes. And that shit is irritating. It is. You know, that's not a conversation. That's mental masturbation. It's pathetic. It really is. In order to communicate with someone, you have to talk with them in the ways that you, you know that they communicate. You've got to work at that sort of thing. You've got to, you know, figure out where someone is coming from. But if you're in this mode where all you can do is just spout things all out as if it's some sort of a, a term paper, Sorry, you know, you can you can try to say, well, well, society should, one of those things again, society should uh, uh, be uh, more intellectual. 
It's like a lot of that shit isn't even intellectual. Like I said, a lot of that shit is just purely mental masturbation. It's, it's, it, there's no, there's no, there's nothing to the conversation. I mean, it'd almost be like uh, one person saying it's not Leviose, and the other person is arguing, no, it's, it, 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 it yeah, it is. It, it's, it's not, certainly not Leviose. <laughs> you know, I mean, it's just, it, 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 it ends up arguing about things that aren't, you know, the more intellectual you get, the more you argue about things that don't even fucking matter. It just, and a lot of times it's about semantics. Well, you know, you technically you didn't use do this the right way and didn't say, okay, why don't just, you know, are, are you, is the whole thing to just try to, because to me, when someone starts to, to do that, it's kind of, de it's, it's like an attempt to degrade someone. It's not like any, on any massive level, but it's just like, come on, let's just have a conversation. I'm trying to figure out what you mean, and if I don't, I'll ask. Try to figure out what I mean, and if you don't, then ask. But don't sit there and go, well, I'm, I know so much more about this subject because I, I've done all these studies. Or, you know, just get to the point. The person will, will listen to you more. And if you really, really do know this subject and you know, actually know what you're talking about and it's not just you memorizing clusters of words, then, you know, you might actually get to someone. You, you might actually get them to understand what you're saying. So anyway. <laughs>